think of current blockchain technology and what are the problems that they faced? Mm -hmm. Yeah, since uh, 2009, um, that's the year blockchain uh, invented uh, by Satoshi Nakamura. Bitcoin and second generation blockchain, Ethereum, and third generation like EOS, ADA. Mm -hmm. uh, since then, um, blockchain has been suffering from three very long problems. Uh, actually, uh, I think I'll clearly define these three problems. Conflicting uh, uh, problems, the so-called trilemma. Oh, trilemma? Yeah. What is those trilemma? And um, trilemma simply can be described this way. Uh, scalability uh, cannot be improved uh, without um, uh, harming security and decentralization uh -huh. if we want to improve scalability. Scalability is like expanding blockchain users mm -hmm. from, uh, proportionally. But uh, if we want to uh, increase the scalability of the blockchain, you know, the security and uh, decentralization suffers. Uh, that trilemma uh, means uh, we cannot achieve these three at once. At once. Um, there are many um, <coughs> efforts to fix these problems and by many other blockchains. Of course, uh, KOK Platform also uh, worked hard to solve these trilemma problems. I'm pretty sure we solved these trilemma problems and I evaluated many uh, blockchains. Also, I involved, I was involved in um, blockchain design in my past and career path. So, um, uh, I combine all those experiences and those studies to design a KOK uh, platform. To simplify our design, um, we have three key concepts to solve those trilemma problems. Oh, so KOK platform can yes. overcome those problems? Yes. How? So we how? have three uh, key factors, like um, three uh, pillars of our KOK platform. Mm -hmm. The first one is DPOSS, Delegated Proof of Stake and Service. Mm -hmm. And uh, the second one is Parallel PBFT. Third one is, let me explain that uh, on the uh, whiteboard. Yeah. The first one, um, DPOS, mm -hmm. as I said, um, security and um, scalability is conflict sometimes. By uh, applying DPOS, we can uh, assign block producer mm -hmm. only on uh, uh, DF service nodes. We have DPOS, yes. So delegate proof of stake and service. Mm -hmm. The serviceability mm -hmm. is uh, uh, applied in choosing DP. Mm -hmm. That's the way we can um, avoid bribe attacks mm -hmm. and also scalability issues. You know, I see. also um, to solve uh, security and um, speed problems, um, we uh, uh, designed P PBFT, uh, parallel and uh, practical Byzantine force tolerance algorithm. What is the third one to overcome those dilemma? Please explain. Okay, yeah, um, I need to elaborate a little more mm -hmm. to describe the third one. That's very important. To solve these uh, trilemma problems, uh, the third one is a little bit uh, difficult to describe. Now, um, actually, um, KOK platform has two layers inside, and uh, the bottom layer is, um, you know, main. And the above is um, KOK platform. So, in a larger uh, sense, we say this is a KOK platform, but in a narrower sense, the upper part is a KOK platform, the lower part is a mainnet, blockchain mainnet. Upper part, KOK platform is more like uh, built in, built in DA, interest DA. To solve decentralization problems, KOK platform has um, its own wallet systems. 
This order system um, helps all kinds of like um, property mothers and leasing mothers and uh, state mothers. You know, KOK platform it uses of course a KOK token. You know, other DApps interact with KOK platform and um, with mainnet. This DApps uses KOK token. There also the uh, major uh, service node becomes BP. of this uh, platform. So uh, at the beginning, we will have 21 BPs. And these 21 BPs will be formed uh, seven regions. And uh, three BPs in it. So that's the way we uh, overcome decentralized problems. And with all the systems, uh, we use a uh, proof of participation model, or the, in other words, least proof of stake. So we use this uh, concept to uh, decentralize uh, our uh, network. So um, briefly speaking, um, our uh, KOK ecosystem has uh, um, heterogeneous or um, uh, hierarchical layers, like uh, DF distribution and order distribution. This is the way we overcome decentralization problem.